Okay, so let me start off by saying I had no idea that this was a game where girls dated guy birds. Uh, oh, big mistake there, but we are going to roll with it because this is such a fascinating game. Uh, and also, I think we are going to pursue the doctor's route because he is fucked up in the head and I'm fucked up in the head and therefore I am a fucked up girl. So anyways, uh, we're choosing the council committee or something like that? If you want to, you can, but if you don't, then you're free to go home after school. Uh, cool! Uncle Son is time! Only for the truck team! And pudding! Smashing lots of pudding! What about you, Shirogane? A foolish question. I already hold a position here. Oh, that's right. You became student president when you were admitted. What the fuck? Nepotism ho! What? Don't we get a vote? Ryuta, just coming to school is enough for me. You have to take care of your mother on your own and all. What? Hmm, I wonder what I should do. We should choose a mate. Join the... <gasps> yes! Aw, oh, where's Kendo? Ugh, uh... Uh... Isn't the infirmary where the doctor is? If so... <laughs> Have fun. Yay! This is where the doctor is, right? Today is an elective day. What should I do? Attend? Let's go to music class! <laughs> because I'm sure there'll be. S oh my gosh. Birds study all the great composers like Beethoven and Mozart and. Why does that look like Lenin? We sang birdie melodies! It was a little tiring, but singing together is fun, even though I'm not a fucking bird! I am a girl, but I guess I have the voice of a bird? I'm like, tweet, tweet, tweet! Uh, I leveled up? My charisma increased by five. Oh boy. I'm gonna use all that charisma. Oh, I'm supposed to help at the infirmary today. I shouldn't keep them waiting. Better hurry. Yes! Salutations, Zaringdo. Yuya! That's awfully close to this boss I've been facing on stream. We won't mention her. Are you hurt? So sweet of you to worry for me, but no, I'm the second in command here. You are? I never would have guessed. So you must be insane as well. I couldn't be happier, mon ami. Mystery is the most powerful of aphrodisiacs. Mm, I'm liking this sexy talk. Anyway, our job as staff is to check the medicines and clean up in here. Normally, I'd do that. But today, I've got some stuff I need to take care of. So this is woman's work for you, because I am an egotistical male bird. Dick man. Of course. My thanks, Zarrington. Oh, and don't touch the desk. It's the doctor's mm, personal area. I'll take you somewhere nice in return. Uh, no. Did he just ask me out? Oh, dear God. We're gonna have our first date already! Yay! Anyway, cleaning. Some of these drugs are a little weird. No matter how you look at it, is this really an infirmary? No. Feels more like a human or rather avian experimentation room. Huh? The desk drawer is open and there are files sticking out. Everything was very neat when I was in here last, but maybe the doctor's a bit of a slob. Don't go in the desk, but what should I do? You should totally go in the desk. Because you're going to see files. Order should I be file? Yes! Doctor! Shoo! Da 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 doctor! Yay, more Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairies! 
happened to you? I just got back, but oh my, we do have sticky fingers, don't we? Yes, I'm a very dirty girl. Punish me, doctor! <laughs> well, that's not it. Suzaki asked me to clean. Clean? Oh, I see. You're on the staff now. Mmm, that's awesome. Y yes Did he say anything about going near the desk? Yes. Please do be more careful next time. Curiosity killed the cat, among other things. Ho, 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 ho! <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Let's never do that again. We're always gonna do that. What are you talking about? What the fuck? Ah, sitting at home is so relaxing. Um, you're a human, so wait, are you in a cave? Am I in a cave? I'm a female and I'm in a fucking cave. What? Oh, tomorrow is the class hike. I'm so confused right now. We won't be going far, so I don't have to... Well, health first. I think I'll have some udon and go to sleep. Udon is eel, by the way. Well, that was a short day, so we're going to do this day as well. Today is the hike! We've stopped for a break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? Talk to? Uh, Let's talk to Fancy Pants. Because he is always worth unacceptable in a temper as usual why why do i have to come to a place like this and on foot you have fucking wings i don't care you have wings it's a hike sakia you have to walk for what purpose wait wait a minute birds are hiking oh my god what the fuck am i playing Birds are hiking! Hiking! That makes no sense when they can just fly! Exercise is for peasants. No, for fun, you're supposed to enjoy the change of scenery. Yeah, when you could just, you know, just fly up and see all the nice trees and the flowers and smell the daffodils and yada yada. Look over here, don't we have a nice view? Dot dot dot. Sakya looks like he still has something to say, but he reluctantly comes over to me. I think maybe he's acting angrier than he really is. Sheesh, what a kid. Right. And suddenly it's the 6th of May. Wait, my vitality is 800? I can die in this? What? Today is an elective day. What should I do? Attend? Oh, we're definitely going to attend some math class, learn all about the avian arithmetic. Mr. Nanaki dozed off as usual, but class was somehow good. Anyway, I feel smarter already. Yay, I leveled up and my wisdom increased by five. Sweet. Er, I imagine you're all well aware, but the sports festival is right around the corner. My, do these days go fast. Please think about what you'll do. Sports festival season already? I know, it's crazy. If it were in the fall, it would conflict with the cultural festival. So it's always been in May. That yellow eye. What are you going to do, Ryuta? I haven't decided, but probably the three-legged race. Some birdie has to. Oko-san will handle the marathon! Indeed he will! Because I'm a psychopath! Cuckoo! I might go for him too. I don't know. Either the doctor or... Whatever his name is. What about you, Sakuya? I want to hear Sakuya's theme. It's the best theme ever. You can't... Oh wait, no. Dance to the Shore Plum Fairies. You can't possibly be expecting me to run in some race, can you? I'm royalty! It's... It is a sports festival. Is there some event that doesn't involve running? Birds are fucking running! Ah! How about being a cheerleader? Oh dear god. The general. In other words, very well. Leave it to me. Okay... Um, I don't think that's... I should be the cheerleader. I mean, I am, after all, a female. 
Also, the first aid team is always shorthanded, so I'm sure they could use help if any birdies still can't decide. That's all for today. Yay, do I get to go explore now? Okay, Okosan. That's the other one. Fuck the childhood friend. Might be running the first aid tent. What should I do? I'll have to think about it. You know you want to... I don't know. What? Oh god. The sports festival was samurais and medieval knights, apparently. Victory or calorie? <laughs> I never did make up my mind. What should I do? All of a sudden. All of a sudden. Let's go to... First aid. Salutations, did you come to gaze into my eyes, Monami? Totally! On my herd had the first aid team... Heard! The first aid team was shorthanded. Salutations! Alas, spurn for the sake of medicine, I must work harder to prove my love. I do not want you. Anyway, happy to have you. As you can see, we have plenty of work to do. Ah, the obstacle course does always hurt a lot of birds. Why use a game designed for hu- Obstacle course. So, you mean, like, some ramps and, like, jumping through things when they can fucking fly through everything? Ah, it hurts! <laughs> These birds are so stupid! Beyond me, mon ami. I suppose it's tradition. You're starting to remind me of Sebastian the Crab for whatever reason. Maybe if the doctor would show up, we could make some progress, but that weirdo hates the sun. Must be worried about his girlish complexion or something. But he is sexy. Uh-oh, they've started. We'll be busy soon. Get ready, mon ami. Yes, sir. And so I spent the sports festival patching up damaged doves with ya Yuya. I think I learned some first aid from him, so it was time well spent. Maybe? You learned first aid from a bird. Congratulations, me! <laughs> okay, this will be the last day, and then I'm gonna cut it. <laughs> the first barrier for all the students who make it this far, the midterm. Oh, dear God. We're getting them back today. Uh, I don't think I did too well. Rarzar! Yes. Hmm, I don't think you did too badly. Y yes? Not too- mm, nope. Sorry, you did badly. You're a fucking asshole. I'm a girl. <laughs> I have feelings. Uh, no. Try harder next time, okay? I'm sorry, teacher. I was too busy eyeing uh, Oko-san and the doctor. I disappoint you, Mr. Nanaki. I'll have to study more from now on. So wait, does that mean I would have gotten a better grade if I would have just attended math nonstop? There's nothing to look forward to but summer heat. It does smell kind of funny when it gets humid like this. You? Huh, there's a bunch of birds in front of the staff room. What are they doing? Oh, there's Yuya! Yuya, what's going on? Salutation, Zarington. Brian won his seventh Pulitzer. A bird won... A prize for writing. He gestures at a news clipping on the staff room pin board. It says, Brian, the first intelligent pigeon, crowned again. What? Brian, don't tell me you don't know who he is. I think I've heard the name, but... Pigeon blogger. Wait, world's most famous blogger. Man, we all gotta read that blog, you guys. Yeah, when birds were barely intelligent. He's a very skilled writer. Yes, you can tell by the second picture that he is the best writer ever. <laughs> this is the one who suggested that the Dove Olympics be called the Pidge Olympics. Congratulations, Brian. 
you get an A for effort. He's extremely influential. The name was adopted right away. Why don't you look him up right now, Monami? Try googling Brian Pigeon. I really don't want to. I'd love to have influence like his one day influence over women in particular. Uh oh, lunch is nearly over. I do, Zarinto. That actually does kind of sound like a female's name, Zarinto. At least a last name, female last name, cutesy. I don't know. Okay, so I'm gonna end it there for now. <laughs>